In this video, we're going to simplify or reduce the fraction 3 tenths. So what we're trying to do is to get the fraction 3 over 10 in its lowest form. It'll still have the same value as 3 over 10. It'll just be in a reduced form. So I'm trying to find a factor that goes into both 3 and 10. So 3 would go into 3, but it doesn't go into 10. 2 goes into 10, but it doesn't go into 3. So there's really no common factor other than 1 that divides evenly into both 3 and 10. So we can't simplify the fraction 3 tenths. It's just 3 tenths. It can't be reduced any further. If you wanted an equivalent fraction, you could multiply both the top, the numerator, and the denominator by 2 over 2. That would give you 6 twentieths, and that is an equivalent fraction to 3 tenths. They would have the same value. Or you could multiply it by 3 over 3 or 4 over 4. This is essentially multiplying by 1. It won't change the value. That would give you equivalent fractions. But if you're trying to simplify the fraction 3 tenths, it's already in its simplest form. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.